Nine times when Jesus did unchristian things. 1. Jesus paid his taxes with fishy money. Render unto Caesar that which is Caesar's. Jesus said. Yet when the taxmen came, he didn't make it easy. Rather than simply pay them, Jesus called Peter. He told Peter to go to the sea and start fishing. Peter caught a fish and opened its mouth. There was a coin inside. Jesus said the tax collectors were to be paid with these coins. 2. Jesus went on a rampage in a temple. He got really mad at seeing money lenders inside. Jesus was furious at this sacrilege. He immediately began turning over tables and chairs. Then he stood guard at the door to make sure only worshippers would enter. 3. Jesus scolded Judas for suggesting charity. In Bethany, Jesus raised Lazarus from the dead. A dinner was given in his honor. Mary Magdalene took a bottle of expensive perfume. She poured it on Jesus' feet and wiped them with her hair. Judas asked her, Why wasn't this perfume sold and the money given to the poor? It was worth a year's wages. Jesus told him to knock it off, adding, You will always have the poor among you, but you will not always have me. 4. Jesus killed a tree out of pure spite. Jesus was hungry and saw a fig tree by the road. He went up to it, but found nothing on it, except leaves. It wasn't the season for figs yet, but Jesus cursed the tree, saying, May you never bear fruit again. Immediately, the tree withered and died. 5. Jesus taught his followers not to wash hands. Hand washing was a well-established Jewish tradition, but Jesus did away with it. The Pharisees confronted him and said, Why do your disciples break the tradition of the elders? They don't wash their hands before they eat. Jesus told the Pharisees they broke God's law too. They didn't follow the Old Testament to the letter. 6. Jesus killed a herd of pigs. Jesus was performing an exorcism. He asked the demon's name. The demons said their name was Legion, for we are many. They asked to be expelled into a herd of swine. Jesus went along, but then sent the pigs down a steep bank. The entire herd drowned in a lake. 7. Jesus' message to his followers was brutal. In fact, it sounds like the words of a cult leader. In Luke 14 26, Jesus explicitly tells them, If anyone comes to me, and does not hate his own father and mother, and wife and children and brothers and sisters, yes, and even his own life, he cannot be my disciple. After a string of analogies, he sums it up. Those of you who do not give up everything you have, cannot be my disciples. 8. Jesus didn't let a disciple bury his father. He and his followers were preparing to cross a lake. One pleaded, Lord, first let me go and bury my father. To which Jesus abruptly replied, Follow me, and let the dead bury their own dead. 9. Jesus refused to find time for his family. We know very little about Jesus' brothers, but his mother Mary at least is celebrated, so it's hard to explain the attitude he displays in Luke's Gospel. Jesus' mother and brothers came to see him. They couldn't get near him because of the crowd. Someone told Jesus, Your mother and brothers are standing outside, wanting to see you. He replied, My mother and brothers are those who hear God's word and put it into practice.